At the UK College of Agriculture, Food and Environment, we want to say thank you to all those working every day on the front lines and behind the scenes. You help ensure that we provide the instruction, outreach, and research needed for Kentucky farms, families, and communities as we battle the coronavirus. Our instructors have made the transition to online instruction very rapidly to serve our students. During the week of spring break, the Center for Student Success, college-wide information technology and communication staff, and many others have assisted faculty and staff in gaining the technical skills to make the transition and continue to aid whenever needed. And the transition is going very well. Also, staff in the Kentucky Small Business Development Center and the Community and Economic Development Initiative of Kentucky are working around the clock to support small businesses impacted by the coronavirus. They are providing guidance and information as Kentucky's entrepreneurs and business owners consider options for loans and many, many other needs. Cooperative Extension Service agents and specialists are certainly on the job and they are providing timely information to families and farmers across the state. They've transitioned to online resources for um, health, finance, food preparation, youth development activities, and many more things. They are providing packets for families to support 4-H programming and assisting their communities with food distribution while social distancing. Cooperative Extension is also serving as a hub in many offices for needed supplies, working with health facilities to make needed masks and shields and much more. And the Kentucky Extension Homemakers Association is helping with many of these activities. Collectively, we want to thank the farmers who are working every day to provide this country with a safe and abundant food supply and supporting our signature industries. For example, equine and spirits. Extension agents, specialists, and researchers remain on the job to support Kentucky agriculture. They're providing farm families in this critical sector of Kentucky's economy with advice and information. The Department of Homeland Security has designated the food supply from production to processing as critical infrastructure, and we are helping in every way we can. One of our livestock extension economists is on a small national team charged with advising the federal government on relief packages for an important cattle industry and other food animals. Lab technicians and researchers are working daily at the Veterinary Diagnostic Lab, another essential service offered to Kentucky by the university to monitor the health of our state's livestock and equine sector. During the breeding and foaling season for the horse industry, we continue to serve as well as we ever have. The Division of Regulatory Services has inspectors and analysts that are continuing to support milk, fertilizer, feed, seed, and soil analyses. Also, crews on our research farms and Robinson Forest are working to prepare plots and field trials, feed and care for our animals, and monitor forest and stream health. We are supporting the planting season, which waits for no virus. Um, as well as we can while still maintaining our social distancing. We are really thinking creatively and collectively. Our faculty and staff have provided supplies of personal protective equipment to their colleagues in healthcare at UK. At the same time, the James B. Beam Institute for Kentucky Spirits is making hand sanitizer for those on the front lines and is supporting other distilleries in the process. So our time is anything but normal, but we are on the job and our commitment to Kentucky is unwavering. Everywhere we look, we see our people carrying out historic land grant missions to serve the Commonwealth. Thank you very much.